What's up guys, so today I'm doing some little bit of a video today, so today I thought I would test out Powerland makeup today because what do you do on a Monday night? Test out really cheap Powerland makeup, am I right? So I went to Powerland the other day for I don't know, a quick mooch around. So I have decided alongside the way to buy makeup from Powerland, so it's in this bag here right now. And I thought I'll test it out today because I've done these makeup videos before where I test out like bargain store makeup or full face of Halloween makeup makeup and things like that so I thought I would turn up the heat a little and test out Powerland makeup so yeah um I don't know if I'm gonna love it or hate it so I'm actually gonna try and do good this time like every time I make these videos I feel like I just do rubbish and they always end up looking rubbish and I end up looking like a clown at the end of it Hope you guys are excited for this video. If you are excited for this video, guys, so thank you for your video. Just watch out for the video. And don't forget to watch, so let me know what we use next time. And without further ado, let's get Poundland makeup ink. <laughs> I am so dumb. Come on. Okay, so let's have a look at this, shall we? So, I got a Poundland bag full of goodies here right now, so let's have a look. First up, I got these makeup sponges, so the choice was either get like a one pound, so you know, there's like things where you dab into your face, what are you called? Oh, beauty blenders. I was either going to spend one pound getting a single beauty blender, uh. get a package of these makeup sponges, which have all sorts in, so there's like things to apply eye, things, things to apply foundation, like I about to spend another pound getting stuff to apply I think so this actually is a bargain so um yeah. next lovely eyelashes so I'm gonna try and put eyelashes on so as you can see here I have no eyelashes like the hairs on my eyes are very minimal so I'm gonna try and maximize the hairs on my eyes today by putting these eyelashes on so um that's really, really good Next up, we have these nails because I have always wanted to try pound and false nails, so. So these are the products I had to buy from the drugstore. So I had to get this foundation, which is like a matte finish foundation thing. And then it was actually eyebrow pencil thing, which I had to buy from the drugstore, not the lipstick now I remember. So I had to buy this from the drugstore. So this thing costs about two pounds something. This thing costs about one pound something. So it's still fairly cheap. So I'm technically not um, breaking the cheap product thing rule and then this was a lipstick which I bought from Poundland so it's just a normal red lipstick because I feel like red looks good on anybody so I'll kind of win anyway with this red lipstick so can't wait to get that on and finally we have this pack of eyeshadow which I thought oh my god like bargain like I would have I've had to pay one pound for an individual coloured eye pack thing or you can pay one pound for the same thing but in multiple colours so let's make a start shall we so so, first up we need to get this thing open, so, um, can't wait to do that, so. I'm assuming the pink sponge is what I use to do the foundation thing, so. Yeah, I'll, I'll use a pink sponge, and then I'll use, like, the white triangle thing to go around the edges, so. That's the plan of action. Oh my god, I am not looking forward to this. Put one thing here, and then another. Do you suppose, like, kind of, like, dibble-dabble, like, several patches on your face, and then use this to kind of blend it in? I'm a makeup artist now, y'all. Clip. Up, pull up. Okay, I'm gonna try and blend it in kind of. So wish me luck. Okay, my one main concern is is that what you're supposed to do around there, you're supposed to still put foundation on you, yeah, I think you are. Okay, I definitely need to apply more foundation to this thing. Okay, I don't know how much foundation is too much foundation, like I don't know when to draw the line. Okay, so this is kind of what it makes you look like, so, um, yeah, I'm actually quite pleased with actually, I will say. Um, yeah, I just need to apply some more right now to kind of properly, um, make it look like foundation, and then uh, we should be good to go.
Oh my god, I look like a ghost right now. What has just happened to my eyes? Oh my god, I look so different already. Oh my god. Okay, so we have to kind of wait for my face to start baking essentially, which means like dry up and blend into my face. But oh my god, like I still can't get over how different I look. Like I look so different, like I just can't seem to get over it. Right, I think that might qualify as my face being baked because I touched it and it feels dry. So I think I actually might be good to go. So I was going to put my eye lashes on first, but I think I might actually do my eye shadow first. So, okay. So we have this cute palette, so it's like a palette of like blue colours which I thought was really cute So I'm excited for that because my favourite colour is blue and this thing's blue so I'm very excited Well when I can open this thing that is, like how do you open this thing? Two thousand years later Okay so a lot of tugging and trying to snap this thing open later it's finally open so hmm, what eyeshadow should i go for i think i might go for the blue actually so i think i'm gonna be basic and just go for the really dark blue just so it kind of stands out okay well here goes nothing Okay, not bad, not bad. It's starting to kind of take shape now. That's actually not bad to be honest. Like you have to realise I don't ever wear makeup and most of the videos will try makeup. Like I can't ever seem to hack eyeshadows. Like I always end up like going over my head and anywhere that's not within my eyes. And there we have my eye. Okay, you can't even see it. How do you do eyeshadow? Like, do you just like simply... How big are you supposed to do it? To be fair though, it actually doesn't look that bad actually. Like, it actually looks kind of... It looks good for what I normally do it as, so... Next up, I'm going to try and hack eyelash pencil. Not eyelash, but eyebrow pencil thing. I don't know how you're supposed to do this thing, so... I'm kind of nervous, because I actually want this thing to look good. Like, I don't want to look like... A clown. Oh, okay, so we've got this like liquid eyeliner thing, so. Okay, so this is me and my attempt of trying to draw eyebrows, so not very good attempt, I will say. Okay, well that was my attempt of trying to do um, eye things. Speaking of eyes, now time to try and put these eye things in. Okay, so it comes in this like, cute little cartridge. Now time to try and um, hack this thing. Have I done it right? No, I haven't. I have just put... Oh God, I can't. God, I can't do eyelashes. How do you do eyelashes? Okay, well that was my attempt of trying to put eyelashes on. Thanks, man. Okay, so this is my attempt of false eyelashes. So last thing now is the lipstick. So I am, um, um, okay. Okay, so not bad, not bad. So, oh my God, like I'm actually surprised I've managed to apply the lipstick, so. Perfectly. Ta-da! So this is my finished product. So I honestly, it doesn't look bad. I have done the nails, but I can only like nail on like a few fingers because these are like insanely long and I still need to do a load of things with my hands. So it wasn't possible to nail all the things on, but you have these cream can kind of nails here. So it looks really good. So this is what I kind of look like. So I will say, now the foundation and lipstick actually isn't that bad actually so I can't say anything bad about the foundation like it's actually quite good but and I can't really say the rest are quite bad either it's just my skills of makeup is just horrendous but yeah I'm gonna leave the video here now guys so I hope you guys liked watching me um try and apply makeup even though I can't do makeup and they have no intention of doing makeup as well so yeah and so yeah, hope you guys have the greatest day ever, and I shall see you guys in another video. Goodbye. Okay,